You can do it. Sorry. There we go. There we go. I believe in you. Come on. Oh. There we go. All right. Now we can begin. What's up, Studio Channel? We are reacting today because we're everyone's favorite reaction channel. Um, are we? It's right. That's what you, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can't wait. Nice <laughs> go us. We are reacting to comments from you, our favorite. We hope, because I don't think they're all nice comments, but um, yeah. Let's get into it. Yeah. Are we doing me first? I, I think first. I think I'm first. All right. First one, Andrew is the worst. <laughs> Great start. Ben, ben and Brandon is the best bromance ever. Thanks, we agree. I stand Adam and Ellis. Yeah. That was terrible. That was good. Use that one. <laughs> David single-handedly got me interested in photography. I probably used both hands because I had to <laughs> use the camera. <laughs> but I'm glad that you are interested. And I hope that you take a lot of pictures. It's clear Miles is the office funny guy. Yeah, I'm actually hilarious. <laughs> See? Mariah needs more screen time. I feel like I like being a little Easter egg. You don't need, you don't want too much of me. You know, you just want to be surprised when I pop in. Sorry, Marquez, but this channel is becoming my favorite. The Tom Studio. 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 Yeah. <laughs> nice. Hey, that means it's a good channel. It's, it's good the stuff. The whole point was to, I'm a subscriber of the Studio channel. I love that we make videos we'd want to watch and we make channels that we'd want to subscribe to. Did Coca-Cola sponsor Brandon? No, I, I wish. That'd be sick. If you're if you're listening, we go through a lot of your soda. Mr. Cola? Coke? Can, Mi I, call, can I call Coke. you Coke? Mr. Coke. Hayato is so pretentious, LMAO. Yes. Uh, I think this was also, yeah, this says it was from the Everyday Tech video. I don't think I came off as pretentious in that one, but I mean, there are plenty of other videos speaking, that he yeah, does. Yeah, that. like, absolutely. <laughs> I wore a Louis Vuitton smart watch for the first one, and you're the pretentious person. <laughs> the Mario movie take did not age well. The movie was a hit. Oh, oh yeah. Roll the clip. <laughs> the Mario movie. That's gonna be a flop in 2023. Yeah, that was probably my worst take since I started working here. I literally could have not been more wrong, and I said it looking dead into a camera mm -hmm. in 4K. <laughs> mm -hmm. Next. <laughs> Why does Marquez have so many employees? I don't see a massive difference in his content that requires all of them. Uh... So, number one, you might not notice a massive difference, but some people do. <laughs> I think the videos are better than they ever could have possibly been. Like, just scroll back six weeks, scroll back six months, you'll start to notice better animation, better sound design, better editing, all that stuff. Mm -hmm. But then two, it's not just better, it's more. This channel wouldn't exist without the people here. Mm -hmm. The Waveform podcast would not exist without the people here. The Autofocus channel. A lot of the videos that we do require collaboration and a lot of moving parts. And there's no way I could do all of it myself. So you might not notice it, uh, but I do. How does Miles use an Apple Watch and a Nexus? I mean, it's quite simple. You just connect it via Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, however you do these things and it works. Um, I'm still rocking the Nexus 6, uh, perfect daily driver. I think by the next EDC I'll upgrade. I've actually been looking into the 6P, I've heard that's pretty good. Um, but for now, this is the combo and you can't shame me for this. Did Andrew get to roll balls from the stairs in Apple Park? Um, no, for that, anyone wondering what that means, Apple Park has these like really cool, like engraved hand railings in the stone, and I said I wanted to roll marbles down it yeah, once. It I've not done it. There's plenty of other reasons maybe we'll get kicked out of Apple. I don't think a bunch of marbles would there be the reason. There was a I lot of that. angry comments. There yeah. were. The yeah, you might have I been, agree. You might have been uh, a little too old for this. I know we're only like a couple of years apart, but do you remember Mighty Beans? Dude, no. oh, yeah. Mighty Beans would have. <laughs> I think that right. That's what I'm uh, saying. That no. was well, sick. <laughs> Always love learning from Quentin Tarantino. Okay, so uh, you should show this photo. There's a there's a photo of young Quentin Tarantino leaning against this dumpster in black and white, and it looks exactly like me. I'll take it for now. I hope I don't look like him when I'm older, but for now I'm good. <laughs> this week's episode brought to you by shot.mkbhd.com. I'm wearing one. Alex is wearing one. 
Are you wearing one? Ellis is wearing one. What the hell? Ellis is wearing one. You're not wearing the You're same not wearing shirt. The same shirt. Oh. I love how, as I fold my arms, yeah, I love how visibly nervous Tim is about his job security. Oh, this is for Dolly. Yeah, no, I was, uh, I was terrified making that video. Not for job security, but just like showing my entire process to the rest of the world. But, uh, no, AI will never come for my job. It's not good enough. You have to understand emotions and people and what questions to ask. I don't think any AI is gonna take my job. Adams, I switched to an actual watch. Love how he casually roasted the Apple Watch. Yeah. It got us. It got us. It's like it, a kiss. Now kiss. <laughs> when I first started working here, one of the first things that Adam and I bonded over was that we were both watch people. Yeah. And now we're both Apple Watch. Apple Watch. It got us. People. Yeah. Hayato has cool tattoos. Thanks. Let's do favorite one on your arm because you can show it off to the kids. Oh, favorite one on my arm is easily this guy. It's the David like, Enhance. This one. How old is that? Because that blue still looks really good. Yeah, I got this in 2019. I got this and then like a few months later, I was like, hey, I really like that design. Um, can we do like a custom one in the same vein? I like the shark, but let's do like an octopus. Oh, it's he the same person. I get, dude, I got this comment every single time on my channel. Is Vin Vietnamese? Hmm. Anyone notice that Tim is buff ASF? As F. As F. I am buff as F. Miles looking kind of jacked though. Once again, AI general. Wait, let's do a comparison here. Are we doing this? Yeah, we're doing this. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's about the same. Wait, it's like the Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's like the meme, yeah. <laughs> yeah, wait, yeah. can we? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why Mariah doesn't go to the events with you guys would be more interesting. Agreed. I do like to go to activities. <laughs> events things are also just like purely hectic. And Listen, like... if you're not gonna roll the marble, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I mean, send me to roll the marble. Hey, I will probably be on parental leave for the next Apple event, so maybe you can take my spot. There you go. Bring the marble, yeah. John and not having LTT backpack is a bit of a slap in the face, to be honest. I actually stole one of the prototypes. I still have, I still have it in my house. Um, the LTT backpack. Yeah, it was a cosmetic sample, and it was pretty good. But then, um, sorry, Linus, uh, I got the Peak Design bag, and man, it's like a world's difference. Here's your LTT back. Oh yeah, see. Oh thanks. Appreciate yeah, that. Appreciate cool, it. Cool, 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 cool. Cadence, get it. Even Cadence doesn't. Yeah, Cadence doesn't move. Oh, hey. Yeah. <laughs> Mariah, that Jenna Julian podcast mug, the feels, dude, I miss the podcast. I went through Same. a wave of going back and listening to a bunch of the old ones during COVID because it's like a little comfort show, you yeah. know? But I don't, I think I got that mug in like college. So it's been probably like six years old. Ellis, the type of dude. <laughs> Ellis, the. Ellis, the type of dude to lick his fingers when flipping pages on an iPad. You are so right. Um, mostly <laughs> because so I am the most pretentious kind of iPad user, where something that 99% of people would not even think about doing on their iPad, I'm like, oh, let me show you. I can do this with my pencil. It's true. Um, and I'm not going to change for anyone. Gotta love Vin's lo fi vibe, man. My guy is chilling. Yeah, I just have on repeat eight hours of lo-fi music that you can study to at mm -hmm. all times chill and study no no just study the, just chi the, study. the chill part that's a different playlist uh mm -hmm. fair i need to hear david's in-depth review of the mario movie immediately <laughs> dude <laughs> so part of the studio channel video for the apple uh event was adam and brandon and i went on a run and i i watched the mario movie on the way to California, and I told Adam all about it. <laughs> My review, I won't do an in-depth review, I'll do a light review. I thought that it was really fun and good for like what they were going for. I thought there was a little bit more, like all the reviews said there was no story. I actually thought that there was a decent amount of story. And the graphics were insane, mm -hmm. and they referenced like everything in the Mario universe. So, no, I thought it was fun. When <laughs> Andrew plays OSRS, I haven't. I live vicariously through a couple of streamers like Settled and Mr. Mammal. That's I think Mariah. Old school, old school. Old, yeah, old school RuneScape. Yeah. Sorry.
Both of these have played it. I think Mariah probably has the most experience in it. I had a party hat when uh, I did not. Yeah, both of them seem to be way better than I was. I've not played RuneScape in like since high school, but yeah. I had a party hat. When it hits, it hits. I want Mariah whole story. She seems like such an interesting person, but it's the mystery. See, if I if I give it all up, there's nothing left that's interesting. Your um, application is probably one of the best applications I've seen out of the... Oh, I don't think I saw it. Like 15,000 applications that I've been through. You looked at um, all 15,000. Not as deeply as all of them. I've been through a lot of applications. You had a very killer application. Well, second favorite, right? Because... Mine. <laughs> no! Okay. <laughs> I haven't seen this one either. Okay. I like how Ellis pestered Adobe for so long for access. And then when he finally got it, he proceeded to roast the heck out of them. <laughs> XD. All right. Listen, I did not roast the heck out of anybody. I had about 12 minutes to explain whether a seismic shift in technology would render me obsolete. So I chose- And half of that was me spraying water in your face. Yeah, exactly. You really that was like the most important minutes. part of the video. <laughs> Marquez is snatching up everyone. Miles from nine to five. Jonathan from LTT. Before you know it, he's gonna have Austin Evans on his team. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Austin's Austin. doing just fine. That's not the first time I've seen that. <laughs> Who is that imbecile kid from eating this thing? It's the Burger King commercial. You've never seen it. I mean, maybe you're in a country where they don't air that commercial. Oh, that's There's fair. a commercial in the United States. Yeah. We're going to, it goes like this. Whopper, 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 Junior Bacon. Du and that's what I was doing. It was hilarious. We all laughed. But no one got it. Low key, the best part is the whiteboard going from sunshine and rainbows to everything on fire, which is chef's kiss. That was from the, uh, the uh, skit that we did. That was a Tim and I idea. Tim illustrated it. Who <laughs> put this one? <laughs> Mariah and MKBHD are indistinguishable. I really wish you <laughs> were doing it with Have him. you ever seen us in the room together before? <laughs> Mariah worked at Nickelodeon, exclamation point. What a cool resume. Um, when I Google my name now, Nickelodeon autofills after <laughs> my name. <laughs> no, it does. Just maybe it might just be me, but I've never Googled that and it came up the first thing. I'm gonna try that right now. Um, yeah, fact check that. Rising, rising, Nickelodeon. <laughs> Let's that's go. so funny. Amazing. Brandon's hair game is on point. Sorry, I was so naggy about it towards the beginning of the channel, but you got it all on the up and up now, bruh. 100. Thank Ooh. you. I appreciate that. David, you'd be an excellent professor. You explain foundational ideas so well. I feel I've grasped the entire concept by the end of the video. I made a distinctive brain mindset change like six years ago that I decided that I needed to understand everything fundamentally and not just know random facts. So that made me really obsessive. And so I, I'm kind of like obsessed with context. So some people used to hate the context, like in the Android Authority videos, I'd be like, today we're gonna review the LG G6. But to understand the LG G6, you have to understand the origin of LG, the company in 1840. <laughs> people didn't like that. <laughs> I'm not wondering about the electric mower. I'm more concerned about the playlist, Creed, really. I see no issues. Same. Um, I accept that comment with arms wide open. <laughs> Excellent pros and cons by David and Marquez, but Alex was disappointing. I mean, dude was defending on Google's behalf and half of his Google Fold criticism was about Samsung. And he stands by it. I stand by it. They made a better foldable. Sorry, <laughs> Samsung people, I guess. I mean. More like a grand slam sung. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Totally. <laughs> Where is Mariah? Did she leave the team? Disheartening, if that's the case. The next video from me on the channel is gonna be why I left MKBHD. <laughs> oh. um, on the on channel. our channel. <laughs> <laughs> on the channel. Ellis repping the Dave Steve Blue Jays jersey was not the crossover I expected. Honestly, Zach M three eight six six. This is my favorite <laughs> comment I've ever received on anything I've ever done. Yeah, no joke. For those of you that don't know what he's talking about, which is I'm, most people, which is probably everybody, <laughs> my favorite YouTube. I'll say it. My favorite YouTube channel right now, Secret Base, uh, led by the Creative Vision. That's a weird way to say waveform. My second favorite YouTube <laughs> channel, creative visionary John Boyce, uh, put out a four-part documentary series on a pitcher from the 1980s called Dave Steeb, and I loved it so much. I went out and I bought a Dave Steeb jersey. It's fake, 
Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I just, I love wearing it in videos because I feel like that doc in specific is like such a great YouTube video that says so much about what a great YouTube video could be that when I make my YouTube videos, I'd love the reference. So thank you for getting it. Thank you for commenting. Yep. I sleep better at night now that Zach M three eight six six has left this comment three hours okay. ago. <laughs> Thanks for uh, commenting. <laughs> you Wait, know, can we actually record with them like this? If you leave more comments, we can do more videos like this. <laughs> I feel so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> and cut. <laughs>